Hello guys, what is up? It is Finn here, bringing you guys some more Failure Friday in the last episode for NHL 18's Failure Friday. But do not worry, we will be doing one in NHL 19. So, the submissions are closed for NHL 18 Failure Friday, but I will be accepting them for 19. However, I will not be including older NHLs. I am trying to not do that for next year's. I want to only do NHL 19 ones. So, um, so yeah, but let's see if we get a 200 likes this episode. I know we can do it, so go ahead, hit that like button, share that love and support, and subscribe and join the Dorsal family if you guys feel ever so kind. And let's go ahead and get this final episode started. So we're going to kick this off with a nice goal, but maybe not too nice for the guy that actually shot it. Take a look at this. He ends up going down and getting hurt on the play. And all his players come over and waiting for him to get up and don't even help him. Just slowly waiting. But it's all good. Now, I literally knew what was going to happen right when I saw uh, where this puck ended up going. So it's going to go off the corner, and I'm sure you guys have guessed what is going to happen next. That is right, going right towards the skate of the goalie. Into the net, every time. So this next one is pretty interesting. Take a look at this. So it looks like this is going in, Laner just failing, and somehow the defenseman kicks it out from the net, and it goes more towards uh, center ice. So I thought that was pretty weird. Should have been kicked in the net, but, um, but yeah, I'm sure the team is very happy that that did not go in the back of the net. Let's take a look at this picture so you might not see anything until right here look at that oh for 95 on the power play columbus has some work to do when it comes to uh to penalty or power plays that's for sure they might want to get some extra work in so this next clip is a little bit of a bummer take a look at this this guy's going to take this shot he's going to freeze it and this guy's right on top of him so here you can have it or just put it in my own net. That works too. I could have done that. I'm sure the goalie is saying, "Oh, big bummer." I think this is something that we've all become familiar with in this series. Take a look at this. Just a, a weird glitch that should not be happening in this game. I mean, definitely an easy goal right there. It's one thing if he got hit and couldn't take the shot, but just a very frustrating glitch and I would be very upset if that happened to me. But yeah, I would be absolutely furious. Okay, so this next one, I must say, is actually pretty funny. So take a look at this. We got 22 with the puck. He's going to take the shot. Flinches a little bit, but he makes a save, freezes it, and then we got a run in. So now the puck is in the crease, and if that guy gets up, it probably won't count. But no worries. The goalie will just put it in his own net, and that, that counts. Very lucky goal there. Definitely one that shouldn't have happened, but I'm sure he's not going to be doing any complaining. We got a little bit of a quick clip here, so take a look at this. This guy's going to get to the puck. He's going to clear it down the ice, and then the defenseman is going to get it. And let me just put it right on my goalie skate so he can kick it right into the net. Good thinking there. All right, so quite a um, a little uh, funny... Uh, <laughs> hit here so this guy gets absolutely drilled by Carlson and uh, this player is not getting up and then Carlson just goes down I guess over the guy's stick so I don't know if that should have been tripping but maybe Carlson should watch his step okay so I thought that this clip was pretty funny to show you guys how the goalie reacts so take a look at this this goes off this guy's skate his leg and just Crawford has a lot of problems trying to corral this thing. I don't know what he was trying to do, but he did not do a very good job. So, awesome goal scored by the user player there. Well done. Alright, got another funny little collision clip for you guys here, by the way. Love the colors on the jerseys. But take a look, this guy gets hit, and then he takes out his own guy. Absolutely love it. Very funny there. Now to the not-so-funny side. Take a look at this. Oof. Yikes. Yeah, not something that um, I would want to happen to me. That's for sure. So how about this nice uh, 
lucky goal for Hosang. Take a look at this. Takes a nice shot, but right at the goalie. Santini, don't worry, man. Let me get this out of your way for you by putting it in your own net. Oh, you got to love the defenseman in this game. So this is a nice, funny little own goal right here. Take a look at this. Not only does this own goal occur to the help of one defenseman, but how about two? Take a look at this guy. Boop. And the goalie will kick it in to add the icing on the cake. Not quite sure what was said in this clip between these two players, but I got a feeling it was something like, hey, man, you ran into my own goalie. But, Carrie, I'm going to need you to get out of the way here so I can get into this fight. There you go. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. How about this one right here? Another uh, great, smart AI in this one. Goalie's going to come out and play the puck. Oh, you're right there. I'll give it to you. And just put it in my own net for me, please. Thanks. Appreciate it. So take a look at this quite powerful shot. He's going to rip this one, and this will not be the only one you see in this episode. Right on through the net, and judging by the crowd's reaction after they notice that the puck went through the net, I am going to assume that this was a good goal, and that accounted. So I think this next one could be classified as both pretty impressive, but also quite the fail. Nice bat, and then the goalie kicks it in off the post. Or the crossbar. Nice. So here we go. We got another fight. Another two guys that are just very hesitant to go at each other. So take a look. I mean, but what's odd about this one is that play is still going on. You can tell by the goalie and the guy skating around that there is still hockey being played. So very odd uh, clip. Oh, there we go. Now, now we're ready to go at each other. Nice. Another short clip, but quite a uh, interesting way to react again. Hit, boop, look at that. How about that? Very interesting. So this one is from an older NHL, but I had to include it. One goalie goes down, but here comes the other. He'll go down too and take out someone else. Nice, and I love how the goalies just stay there too. I love that. Take a look at this next clip, and man, what a way to win in overtime. Okay, this is me playing Buffalo. We're in overtime. Here's Riley, Ryan O'Reilly. I have a delayed penalty here. And uh, he breaks towards my goalie to take a shot. But he decides to do a drop pass. Misses everybody. And, yeah. A lot of pissed off Buffalo Sabres fans and embarrassed players right now. Bang, there's the game winner in overtime. Thank you, Ryan O'Reilly. Yeah, that was a real gift there. I think you should send him a thank you card after that one because that was definitely something that does not happen very often. So very lucky overtime winner. So here we go. I told you that we did not just have one for this episode. Take a look at this one. Eakin with the puck. He'll take the shot and it hitting off the iron is not going to slow it down enough for it to not go through the net. Nice shot there. All right, we got two more clips for this episode. So here we go. This one is a little crazy, but this goal actually counted. Look at that. Just a weird glitch on how it just goes through the net. And that counts too, and it's an EASHL game. Very odd how that ended up counting as a goal, but... I've seen, you know, stuff similar to that. And, yeah, it's something that we hope, I'm sure, to see fixed in next year's title. Or, I should say, this year's title. All right, guys, here is the last clip for NHL 18 Failure Friday. Take a look at this. Is this one going to trickle through? Nope. It'll just teleport right back under the goalie. So close. Almost had it. Huh. <sighs> well, guys... That is going to do it for NHL 18 Failure Friday. But don't be sad because it will be coming back in NHL 19. I don't plan to start it next week, but the following. So we will take a little break off. And um, and yeah, but I'm very excited to start it back up again. That is for sure. But guys, that is going to do it. I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all so much 
for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And as always, I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.